I'm Rose and welcome to another episode on Only Pan. We are going to be cooking chicken pot pie. I got this from Pillsbury.com and let me tell you, this is better than buying the frozen chicken pot pie in the freezer section. This is almost from scratch. Stella, she says, hey guys, hey. Please like and subscribe and also don't forget that notification bell so you can see new videos whenever we upload. So let's get on to this video. So these are the ingredients you'll need and your cooking equipment. One third cup butter, one third cup of chopped onion, one third cup of all purpose flour, half teaspoon of salt and one fourth teaspoon of pepper. Progresso chicken broth, you'll need one cup and three fourths of it. Half a cup of milk, Two cups and a half of shredded chicken. This is from the commissary. It was already cooked, so I just shredded it. I know, this is lazy cooking. Two cups of mixed vegetables. And right here, the Pillsbury pie crust. So with your pot right here, turn it to medium heat. You're gonna wanna add your butter and melt it. When that's melted, add your onion. Cook for two minutes and stir frequently. Stir in flour and salt. Should look like this. And then gradually add your chicken broth. And then add half cup of milk. Yeah. When this is bubbling and looking thick, you're gonna stir in your chicken and mix the veggies. So that looks good. Turn off the heat and remove it. Dang it guys, I forgot, but turn your oven to 425. Dude. Awkward angle, but so you want to whip out your crust and roll this bad boy. I don't know why people say that. What the heck? Anyways, dang, this fits perfectly. Now fill it with your pot pie mixture. Smooth it out like this. Now get your second pie crust and then. Put it on top and then just form it to the pan to pot, to pot pan. So when your oven's ready, bake it for 30 to 40 minutes. So for the last 15 to 20 minutes, you're gonna want to take the pie out, cover the crust with foil so the crust doesn't end up burning. When that's almost done, I want to show you my spice rack. Oh my gosh, I almost touched it. That's what she said. <laughs> Anyways. Now you're gonna to wanna to cover the edges with foil. Should look like this. And then pop this back in the oven for 15, 20 minutes. Use your handy dandy oven timer. So it's ready. I forgot to say, but you're supposed to Cut little slits on top so the, the air would escape, but I didn't do that. I just cut a few slits right now. Look at that pie. So you're gonna wanna let it cool down for about like five, 10 minutes, and then you can eat a slice. So there you guys have it, your chicken pot pie from Pillsbury.com. This ain't your prettiest slice of pie, but let's do a taste test, shall we? Hot. This is banging. 10 times better than the frozen chicken pot pie. Yeah, thank you for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.